What's up guys and gals of the internet, it's me Logan here from The Juice, thanks for tuning in and today we got some really cool news to talk about, something that I'm personally pretty excited for, Assassin's Creed and of course Far Cry 5. Now they say that loose lips sink ships and if that's the case then Ubisoft is practically the freaking Titanic at this point because those dudes haven't been able to get a game out without it leaking since... I don't know, probably 2012, but it's kind of cool that these things leak because then it gives us something to talk about. So we're going to talk about, of course, the leaked image that popped for Assassin's Creed, the new one that's coming out, being referred to now as or officially called Assassin's Creed Empire. It's set in the Egyptian times. And how do we know this? Well, if you look at the screenshot, you will see it's a guy on a boat and what maybe insinuated the Nile or some type of river in the Egyptian era but we know because there are temples and if you look in the top left corner of where it usually gives you kind of like your quest or your mission objective it's to go find somebody in their place or whatever and people on the nice place of Neogaf have figured out that that is of course one of the rulers of an Egyptian pharaoh uh, during one of the Egyptian eras, I'm not sure which, but you also see a really fun little side objective also, which is kill the crocodile or assassinate the crocodile, a crocodile, and I think that's actually pretty funny that you're going to be running around stabbing crocodiles, maybe, hopefully, maybe there's like a Assassin's Creed 4 type thing going on here, where you take the, the leather and you get to craft something and you get better armor and stuff like that, maybe more hunting, but of course you are in the desert, so I don't know, maybe you're going to get like freaking twigs, because there's not a lot of water there. Not a lot of things roam around the desert. Maybe a camel. Ride camels, maybe. I don't know. But I'm excited for it. Because when I think Assassin's Creed, I think slaves. So maybe you are recruiting slaves from that are building the pyramids and stuff, you know. And it will be like Assassin's Creed Brotherhood type stuff going on. Where you have your slaves and you kind of change what they wear, what color they wear, what type of weapons they have. And they actually help you in combat maybe even. Hopefully that's the route they're going. Or at least that's what I would prefer. Uh, there were also other leaks and reports that I've looked up that have said that there they may be expanding the game out of just Egypt and maybe you'll be able to go to Greece and other areas like that. And the reason that being is because there is naval combat once again and very kind of like rudimentary type ships. So I'm kind of curious how that goes because I didn't think there were cannons in the Egyptian era. I don't know. Somebody in the comments below let me know because I'm not totally sure. There was another leak. For a new game coming out, there was a film crew in Montana, the local newspaper there found that there was somebody filming for something at a really old church in Montana, and that led to the question, what are they filming? Well, when they asked, they were told they're filming something that is a global franchise, which led a lot of people to think, oh, Red Dead, but come to find out through other means of research that I did on the internet, this company that was there filming at this church was the same company that made the live action trailer for Far Cry Primal. And a lot of people, like I said, insinuated that this was Red Dead, but Red Dead and Rockstar, they don't do live action trailers, so that wouldn't make a total sense, but Far Cry does. So a lot of people are speculating that this is Far Cry and Far Cry 5 will be set in Montana. And so, there means this could be one of two things there was a report a while back of a leak or somebody who called into somebody i think it was giant bomb maybe I, I can't quite recall the details but that the new far cry installment was set in montana and they were it's going to be based on them taking on like a local militia that's taken over the wildlife in places like that in montana kind of almost like a longmire s type thing if you know what that is it's a tv show where you're like a sheriff who you go into like the indian reservations where you don't really have any backup because technically the police may not have jurisdiction there but so you're just this lone sheriff that they let that the indians let allow come in so maybe something like that or possibly it could be a western because as ubisoft has done before there was i think it was a couple years ago they put out a poll saying where would you like the next far cry set and there were things that were like uh dinosaurs and something else and then there was a 19th century spaghetti western and this is similar to what they did with the assassin's creed series ubisoft because they put out a poll before assassin's creed 3 came out asking where would you like to see the assassin's creed series go what what time period and a big one was the revolutionary war and then we got assassin's creed 3. so that leads one to speculate maybe this is either a spaghetti western or is it kind of like the current day you're just fighting people in montana in the wilderness and i'm excited for it because montana is a beautiful place and if there's one thing that far cry does right 
it has Nell environments and make them fun and add cool wildlife and things like that. So I'm really excited to see what they do with that in particular. Now, all this is backed up because there was an article on IGN and it was Ubisoft officially announcing that Far Cry and Assassin's Creed and the crew and one other title, I believe, will make a return in the fiscal year of 2017, 2018. Now, if you're wondering what that means or what that exact whole time frame is, it's not like regular calendar. It is, it takes place the very April 1st of 2017 to March. The last day of March, I believe, is the actual fiscal year of 2017 through 2018. So that means we will get another Assassin's Creed this year. And so maybe that means we'll get uh, Far Cry maybe this September because I think that was one of the leaks and maybe an Assassin's Creed in the February slot because I think games publishers aren't afraid of that area anymore who knows maybe we'll get both this fall and therefore we'll have even more things to play and have to worry about trying to buy so it's good news for gamers bad news for our wallets but that's the lovely thing about video games is that there's something for everybody and something we can all enjoy i really am curious what you think about these leaks are you excited about assassin's creed being set in egypt do you think that far cry 5 is going to be a western or just set in modern day montana other than that guys thanks for tuning in once again to the juice don't forget to subscribe comment below thanks for tuning in